Welcome. All right, so what I have here is 1,260 degrees. And uh, that is going to be the sum of the measures of my interior angles of a polygon. But the thing is, I don't know the number of sides. Um, so that's what I want to solve for. So the formula for the sum of any polygon is going to be n minus 2 times 180, where n represents the number of sides, which we're trying to figure out. However, we do know what the sum is. So I'm going to plug in 1,260 in for s, because that represents the sum of a polygon equals n minus 2 times 180 degrees. Now again, what we would need to do is we need to solve for n. So to solve for n, we've got to get the n outside those parentheses. And to get them outside those parentheses, we need to apply the operation of why we have those parentheses. And the operation why we have those parentheses is multiplication. So I'm going to apply the distributive property to simplify the right side of the equation. So I have 1,260 degrees equals 180 degrees times n is 180 degrees n. 180 degrees times negative 2 is negative 360 degrees. Now I have a two-step equation. I look at my variable and say, all right, what is happening to the variable that I need to undo? Well, you can see that the variable is being subtracted by 360. So we always undo addition and subtraction first. So I'm going to add 360 degrees on both sides. Therefore, I'm going to have 1,620 degrees um, equals 180 degrees n. Now, all I simply need to do is, again, solve for n. And I notice that my n is being multiplied by 180 degrees. So to solve for n, I'll just divide by 180 degrees. And when I do that, um, I end up getting 9 equals n. Therefore, when the sum of the measures of the interior angles of a polygon is 1,260, I have nine sides, which is going to be a nonagon. Thanks.